Fans of Britney Spears are very concerned after the singer deleted her Instagram account with no warning. Now fans are frantic to find out why, especially after Britney had previously posted that she was crying oceans. This is odd for many who have been following her because Britney has been very active since getting out of her conservatorship. Britney has frequently used her Instagram page to share stories of her conservatorship, post candid snaps, and even tease some snippets of upcoming projects. However, now those fans will have to find content through Britney fan pages because any attempt at reaching her page results in a message saying, sorry, this page isn't available, usually followed by uh, the link you followed may be broken or the page may have been removed. Thankfully, her Twitter page is still up if she needs to call out Jamie Lynn again, but that still hasn't stopped her fans from worrying about her. One user tweeted, Britney Spears deactivated her Instagram account. I am deactivating my whole social media. I can't live without her videos. The deleting of her account comes after Britney posted a photo of herself holding her puppy Sawyer. And in the caption, she writes, my baby is getting bigger. I will just say it. Just like when my boys got bigger, it literally sucks. They don't need me anymore. I've cried oceans for my boys boys and I'm not lying. Oh well, but Sawyer, he's bigger, but he will always need me and I like that. As for Britney's Twitter, her final message on there was one directed at her sister Jamie Lynn, who as many of you know, recently wrote an autobiography titled Things I Should Have Said. After watching her interviews and seeing that a lot of the book had to do with her conservatorship, Britney wrote a lengthy response on Twitter. In the first part, she says, Jamie Lynn, I don't think your book is about me at all. I said some harsh things because you obviously hurt me by the things that you were making up about me. When I said only a scum person would make up things like that about someone, I could have sworn I said, but you're not. But it doesn't make sense at all to me what you're saying. I know you worked hard for the life that you have and you have done amazing, but I think we would both have to agree to the fact that the family has never been remotely as hard on you as they have been on me. What dad did to me, they don't even do that to criminals. So for you to sit back and act completely aloof to what has happened to me is honestly insane to me. Do you know anybody who worked as hard as I did and the hours I put in? And looking into why Brittany deleted her account a little further, I came across an article by Us Weekly where they claim that a source told them that Brittany chose to disable her own Instagram. This also isn't the first time that Britney has taken a break from Instagram. Back in September, she temporarily put her account on hold while she privately celebrated her engagement to Sam Asghari. Taking to Twitter, she wrote, Don't worry, folks, just taking a little break from social media to celebrate my engagement. I'll be back soon. This time around, though, it could be to focus more time on her book. According to Variety, a source confirmed that the singer landed a $15 million publishing deal with Simon & Schuster. From what we know, the book will be going into extensive detail about Britney's rise to fame, her music career, and more importantly, her conservatorship, as well as her relationship with her family. The best part about all of this though is that she will finally have a chance to truly speak and speak beyond a cryptic or sometimes direct Instagram post. According to page six, the deal came after a huge bidding war as well between multiple publishers. Whatever her reason though for deactivating Instagram, I'm sure she'll be back soon. I'd love to hear your thoughts on all of this though because that's all the time we have for today. So stay classy and I'll see you on the next one.